Hello and welcome to another Vi Minecraft video. Even blah, blah, blah. Um, this is episode number whatever, and really, this is just going to show you what we've done with the um, roller coaster. I apologise for not uploading any of the making of footage. It was very boring. We were just sat there waiting for glass to be made, and all the other times it was it was just really boring, and the FPS was so low. Uh, I don't know what's up with my computer right now. I'm going to do a clean of it and hopefully I will get the FPS back up to normal. And without further ado, I will show you this. The first part you recognise is just the whole standard thing. This all started out with the idea that, oh, could we get it a roller coaster to go oh. one way and then come back and go the other way? Which is exactly what we just did there. And the next thought was, oh, could we make it do a jump? There's a jump. Could we make it do two jumps, but like further apart? And there, uh, the first one uh, figured out that we boost it. We can make it to the second one. And there's that's the second idea. The next one was just, you know what? We have a giant house. What can we do with it? Let's put a roller coaster. Through. It's not really a roller coaster. It's just sort of a tour. And we haven't actually done much with this. That's a ladder in there, up to the animal farm, kitchen. Um, we haven't done much in here since we've been concentrating on other things like the roller coaster, figuring out this addition, seeing um, how it could fit in and everything. Next was just I wanted to see what happens if you <laughs> go around in a circle really fast. Nothing much happens. We need to sort out these parts where he get hurt, like on that first corner and this corner, or that, that jump. And this was just sort of, I want to incorporate the tower. We were going to go up it, but we, we couldn't figure out at the time how to do it. And then trapdoors was released at this point and this is what we did with the trapdoors. Haven't actually found a use for it other than this. Apart from the obvious. Um and then went down, 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 down. And back up. We thought that was pretty cool. So come out and I did this when John wasn't here. So Nice little outside bit. And there's a massive world hole in my castle. And then John decided we should go really deep down. And I've just gone through a wall there. I don't know how. And then you only just make it up here a few times. It's like, uh, yeah, yeah, there you go. And we get back outside. And you notice why we had to wait for the furnaces there. You saw what a glass addition. And this is it. If it works, hey. go on. Yeah, see that piston? It pushes onto the other track. It's kind of obvious what was going to happen, and this one's quite good. I, I actually really like this. Stay and then track appear in front here, and then reset themselves. All those, all the redstone done there, is partially ideas that were found from, like, on how how it could possibly be done. So like knowing that the redstone can be. Um, Knowing that redstone can be act, act as a switch with detector rails, um, that that's a key part to it. God, it's there, um, but everything else, I wired it pretty much, and John helped as well. He actually came up with a way to do it. But yeah, uh, that's the roller coaster. I uh, hope you enjoy the addition. That piston, when I said yeah, it worked. It doesn't always work. <laughs> And it's kind of annoying because you have to get out and then go back to it and then go again. But yeah, it worked, so I'm quite happy with that. Uh, thank you for watching, and I will hopefully be uploading more Minecraft um, whenever we get decent footage of us doing something interesting rather than waiting for glass to um, smelt in the furnace and iron and stone and stuff like that. So until then, I will see you later.